Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Well, the wait is over. The picks for the new Safari 2021 lineup have leaked online. So without further ado, let's just dive right into this. First up is their new Tyrannosaur. Now, there was no names attached to these pictures when I stumbled upon them, but on Safari's website, when they teased those blurry images, they said this species had the longest proportional arms of any Tyrannosaur species, so that would lead one to believe that this is Despletosaurus. And I'm so excited for this. I've been wanting a good Despletosaurus figure for such a long time. Yeah, Collecte has one, but it's in a crouching position, which I don't mind, but has such a derpy looking face. And I absolutely love the color scheme on this. The green and yellow has a very Dino Riders vibe. And, you know, I'm old enough to remember Dino Riders. So this definitely hits the nostalgia button. So needless to say, I am super excited for this Despletosaurus. Very excited to get my hands on this one and do a full review on it. And next up is their Baryonyx. It's so nice to see Safari going back and updating their old Carnegie sculpts. And I love the brown and yellow color scheme on it. It's very simple, but it's also very natural looking. The head sculpt on this is absolutely beautiful. And the heavy claw, which Baryonyx is known for, is painted in a black color. This is truly an outstanding model. It looks like it's pulling off that bipedal pose beautifully. Another figure from them that I am highly anticipating. Can't wait to get my hands on it. And next up, shouldn't come as a surprise to anyone, it's their updated Spinosaurus with the new paddle tail. We all knew this one was coming. It was so easy to decipher from that blurry image that they teased over the last few weeks. And this Spinosaurus looks absolutely fantastic. So it's definitely the year of the Spino 2.0. Like over a year ago, every company was releasing their quadrupedal Spinosaurus. Now everyone's rushing to get one out there with the paddle-like tail. But I have to say the brown and blue coloration on this figure looks absolutely fantastic. That blue really makes the figure pop. I love the white coloration between the neural spines. And it's definitely a major update to the one that they released in 2019. That swimming pose really didn't do it for me, but this one is definitely doing for me and I can't wait to get my hands on this one. And next up, now these two figures coming up are not part of their prehistoric animals line. These are part of their mythological creatures line. First up is their armored Tyrannosaurus Rex and what a Dinotopia vibe I'm getting from this thing. And also a Dino Riders vibe that uh, headpiece on the T-Rex kind of reminds me of a brain box and that armor is really well done it has a nice dark wash over it bringing out some really nice detail definitely a really interesting take from safari it's definitely not going to be for everyone but i am tempted to pick this up and lastly is their armored triceratops this is another cool looking figure that invokes that dino riders dinotopia vibe i actually really like the color scheme on this i really wouldn't mind if they went back and repainted their uh, 2018 Triceratops in this color scheme, I think it looks really, really cool. I love the black stripes on the frill. So definitely a very interesting take on probably the two most popular dinosaur species of all time. I'm kind of on the fence about picking up those two, but most likely I'll probably grab them just for the nostalgia vibes. So that'll do it for this update. The two figures I'm looking most forward to are the Despletosaurus and Baryonyx. I think those two figures look absolutely fantastic. The Spinosaurus is also very well done. Seems like everyone's trying to get in on that paddle tail Spinosaurus rush. I'm sure Collecte probably has one planned for this year. So let me know in the comments what you guys think of these reveals. Which ones are you most looking forward to? And as always, if you're enjoying the content on this channel, show your support by hitting that subscription button just below the video. Each subscription helps out the channel tremendously and is greatly appreciated. And I'll see you guys for the next one.